Now that we have our Rex army and we grinded the caves to get the artifacts, it's time we travel to the obelisk and teleport to the boss arena and fight the Gamma Monkey. Thank you guys for joining me for this adventure and shout out to today's comment by Timolo0108 who said, nice. Thank you, my friend. <laughs> All right, guys, the time has come. It has come for us to actually go out there and defeat the Dimfagivigivis King or whatever. Whatever is, I don't know his name. I don't know what his name is. The giant monkey, we're gonna kill him. All right, we got everything we need. We got a Rex army. Um, we got the Daydons over there chilling with the food or whatnot. Don't give me an admin mode. <laughs> uh, we got the Uteranus over there. Um, and I went ahead and just packed these guys full of just cooked prime meat just for the Daydons. And then we also got all of the artifacts we need. We got the excessive other types of resources that we need. The only thing's done now is we just gotta get over there. All right, we just gotta get over there. I I'm gonna I'm pack all the dinos up. I'm gonna get over there. I'm probably gonna go to the green one because I think that has the most space. And uh, hopefully, hopefully everything goes well. All right, let's do this. All right, so this is my first time doing this and I'm assuming that from the videos that I've been watching is that uh, I just, that was a really loud noise. I just pretty much have to take out all of the, my dinos and then craft the, craft whatever this guy is, craft that and then they'll all get teleported to like the, the killing chamber pretty much or the, the boss room. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, hopefully I'm not wrong and this actually works. All right, so I've got everyone out. Um, all the Rexes are here. We got three Daydons. I already put them all on passive healing. Put some food in their inventory. They roughly all have around like a thousand uh, prime meat inside of them. So that's a good thing. And the last thing we need to do, I'm assuming, is uh, just, just take this guy here and uh, put everything in here. And then I can just craft it, right? Okay, so... First, what I actually want to do is whistle, attack my target. I don't want all of them on the passive because that's not smart, right? Um, and then we're all going to get teleported, right? And I just have to hop on my UD and that's it? I'm assuming? Alright, I'm assuming, I, I really don't know, but I'm assuming that's what's going to happen. So we make it, okay. So we get 30 seconds, right? How do I know the range of? Oh, that's not that's not a big range at all. Okay, that's not a. Big... Everyone seems to be in inside the range though. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, <laughs> I was a little scared. Yeah, this is not a big range, but everyone's in there, which is good. So, okay, I think we're good. Maybe I should uh, just go ahead and send out a, a quick roar, real quick. Let me uh, make sure I'm in here. I don't think my data has got the roar, but I think it's fine. All right, and game's frozen. Oh. Okay. Are we here? Uh, okay. Is there a time limit or uh, like, <laughs> uh, is there a certain time that I have to do this by? by or um, how does this work? I'm assuming we go in there. This place looks nice, by the way. I've never seen this area before. This place looks dope. I guess we all, um, everyone follow me, but don't fall off into the water. Whatever you do, don't fall into the water. I wonder if I could like, I wonder if I could cryopot them still or not. I actually don't know. All right, everyone on me, on me, on me. All right, army, army, look at you guys. Holy Jesus, you guys are amazing looking. All right, guys, let's do this. Okay, we're gonna go in here. We're gonna kill this guy because he's, he's an evil man. He's an evil overlord. He's an evil monkey. Okay, we're the good guys in this situation. We're definitely not going in someone's home and just killing them for no reason. We're the good guys in this situation, guys. Right, guys? Exactly, guys. Exactly. You're getting the gist. You're getting the idea. How how long do I have to... How, oh, I see a health bar. I see the health bar. Everyone's with me. I gotta make sure everyone stays with me. I don't... You taking a shit back there. I need, I need, I need, I need, I need everyone with me, okay? What is there? Two, two waves? Uh, the health bar is this way, so I'm gonna just go this way. Um, this, this area seems to be, like, a, a lot open all right guys you see him up there you see him up there guys look at him he's sleeping he's asleep we gotta wake him up donald pip is this team with three hundred and seventy-five thousand health you guys we could do this okay we could do this we could do this does it we, we could do this i'm assuming like do i get closer or uh like i don't think there's a time limit i don't see a timer thing so maybe we could just stay in here forever really um 
But I'm assuming I could just get closer, as close as I want, and then just like straight up attack. Let's see. I'm gonna make you, everyone stop following me. Everyone stop following me. I got a shotgun on me. I'm pretty sure it can reach all the way over there. I'm gonna give you guys a nice little boost real quick. You feel me? I told you to stop following me. God damn it, Rex, stop it. All right, everyone, everyone get their boost. Everyone ready? All right, I got my shotgun out. Oh, wait, no, I don't. Now I got my shotgun out. And I'm assuming I can just hit him and the battle begins. Uh oh, oh, uh oh, let me get back on my duty brothers. Holy, I got dismounted, attack him. Everyone attack him. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to just get, just get, I can't fly in here. All right, we're getting on the Rex. We're getting on the Rex, cause I'm not getting on the ground. I'm not about to get on the ground with all those Donificuses on me, bro. I don't know where my Uranus went. That guy is somewhere around here. I don't know where though. I wasn't expecting to straight up get dismounted like that. I actually think he's fighting my UD. Oh, he doesn't even matter. Dude's at half health. He's not, he's not standing a chance here. He's not standing a chance here. I got the heals going on. I got everything going on right now. What's my health at? Oh, it's, it's tremendous. Look at this dude. What the fuck is he stopping here? Are they flying on side of macros? Oh, he, he fled. He's pussy, bro. He's fled. He fled. Where'd he, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Holy, what is happening? Everyone okay? Are we good? Are those grenades, bro? Hop off my dude with the grenades, bro. Oh my God, I'm taking damage. Or am I? I see blood on my screen, but my health bar is fine. So I actually have no idea if I'm taking damage or not. I just seen blood on my screen. Where's dude at? Is he coming back? Or, or wait, is that him over there? Or like, what's going on here? Where do he go? There's no way it's him over here, right? Y'all are just. No, that's not him over there. Is everyone okay? Let me get back on my. Uh, get back on this guy. Where? Where? where am I? I'm so confused. Who are you guys fighting over here? Who are we fighting? Oh, he's just up there. So he's just chilling up there. Okay. All right. I guess he's just chilling up there. All right. Everyone, uh, neutral. Everyone neutral. Attack whoever is attacking you. That's what we're doing right now. Attack who's ever attacking you. Everyone's neutral. Kill all the, all the, all those guys. All those guys gotta die. I don't know how we're gonna get up there to kill them though. To be honest, they're just flying. Maybe I just gotta hop on my shotgun. Maybe I have to, I think I have to kill all of these guys and then maybe, um, maybe he'll come back down. I'm thinking that's what we gotta do right now. Oh, I shot my own team. I don't wanna get hit by a, a, a rocket launcher, not a rocket launcher, but a grenade though. It seems like everyone's just standing still or something. Oh, that, that hurt. Okay. <laughs> that hurt a lot. Excuse me. Can I, can I guess, can I get some help over here, Rexus? I'm all alone. All my teams have left me because the fucking giant Dino Pific is, no, I, that, I, I freaking died, bro. How did I die? No. <laughs> all right, guys, I'm back. And, um, it's been, it's been a good little minute. <laughs> It's been a good little while. Um, I have to go back into the caves, get the artifacts, I have to farm all of the, the Aliosauruses, the Sarcos, the Ards and Tavises to get the Talons and everything like that, as you can see. I got, the, I got the artifacts, I got the stuff that we need, so I got the materials to make the thing again, and I've just been uh, pretty much building the army back up, if you would say. Um, they're just over here healing. I got the Daedons over here. They're all eating food. I'm gonna wait until they're all like actually healed up, though, uh, which is probably gonna take a while but i just completely had to remake a whole new army thankfully thankfully we have the farms the uni farms and everything like that and thankfully we also had some backup rexes so we didn't actually have to go out there and tame it um which was really really good really really good right um so now we're just sitting here this guy is actually not leveled what the heck i thought i leveled all of them what we got one more level, but I think everything else is uh, 292, 299, 298, yeah. I think everything else is good. We just got one little straight Rex, apparently, that I accidentally uh, forgot to actually level, which we'll probably do that right now. But um, once we do that, I'm going to go back to the boss fight. And I did watch a video on a guy to actually have to kill the thing. Apparently, the reason why I failed, realistically, was because the freaking Dino Pipix has jumped up on the pillar and was like, I'm just going to be up here 
and my Rex is just was aggroed on him and everything else just pretty much killed me. Um, but new strategy, I'll show you guys as soon as we get into there. Um, and yeah. All right, guys. So I got all the tames out. Everything's ready. Um, except my Uteranus. Apparently he's outside of the circle. Everyone else is inside the circle though, right? All right. I think everyone else is inside the circle. All right. So take two. Hopefully this goes well. <laughs> Hopefully we don't mess it up this time. I do have a little bit of a strategy that I want to try out with the with, the, with everything. Um, hopefully this goes well, though. Everyone's in a circle, right? I think everyone's in a circle. If not, it's too late. If not, it's too late. All right. OK, so this time, this time we will win, guys. OK, trust me and believe. OK, I know I know I failed you guys last time. I know I failed the army last time. Everyone follow me real quick. I know I failed you guys like a little bit of freeze, a little, little freeze. I know I failed you guys last time, but this time, guys, I got you, okay? Trust and believe I got you. Just single file line. All right, single file line. Everyone, everyone get ready. Come on. Make sure you guys are... I don't want anyone to get stuck on anything, okay? All right, go to the left side here. We're all just going to go this way. Come on, guys. I wonder what happens if I go to that ship over there. I wonder if something... There's probably, there's probably nothing in there realistically, right? Do I got the data on with me? Okay, I see a date on. All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. All right, single file line, everyone. Good. No one's getting stuck on anything. I like to see it. Right? Okay, 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 okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I got to make sure. I can't go into this battle with, with a half assed RB, right? I got to make sure everyone's good and everyone's with me. Look at them. Look at them. Look at them just up there. He's up there looking menacing. He's probably asleep. He doesn't even know all this wreck is we're making a bunch of freaking 20, 20 freaking dinosaurs. Big feet. You can't wake up. <laughs> He's in a deep slumber. All right, everyone back here. OK, we're all just going to line up here. OK, just like just like this. Just like this. All right, that's good. All right, that's good. That's good. All right, everyone stop following me and everyone on passive. All right, I will be right back. I got to go shoot big dude real quick because big dude wants to get shot. All right, I got to go shoot him real fast. Just just hold up. I'll be back in a moment. I'll be back momentarily. All right, look at him. Okay, let me go in and turn around here so I can have a clean getaway. And, oh, all right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. False alarm. I wasn't close enough. I wasn't close enough. Let's get into the sun. It's probably, this is probably where it's at, right? Realistically. And... Go, 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 run, run, run. And the big jump up. There we go. Dodge the boo-boos. Dodge them all. Let's go. All right, we got this for sure. We got this for sure. Let's get behind the Rexes. Get behind the Rexes. Let the Rexes take some hits here because they got the most health out of everyone, which is fine. We just need the boss. Come on, boss. Come on, big bag boss. Let's go, big bag boss. Big grenade. Boom! Oh, I was expecting it to blow up there. All right, everyone, get the boss. Everyone, get the boss. Nice. Here's a roar. You guys got this. Get that defense. Get that defense. Get that attack. Let me see. 1,200 hammers. I like to see it. We can take this guy down easily. Easily. You guys got this. What's he at? Well, we've taken like 20% of his health already. Come on, guys. Let me. I got to make sure I get over here. I got to make sure everyone gets a boost. Come on. You guys got this. Halfway done. Not bad. Not bad. What's your health looking like? No one's bleeding. I like to see it. Let's go, guys. We can do this for sure. For sure. Let's make sure he doesn't run away. Take him out before he runs away. You know how he be. You know how the big dinosaur be. Come on now. Oh, yeah. That's done. That's a done deal. That's a done deal. Let's go. Tech replicator generator trough gate. We got everything. We got everything we need. I, we got some leggings, too. I got to put those on before the next boss. Actually, can I unlock those now or like, do I have to wait? Okay. Are these already unlocked or like, do I have to spend engrams on them or let's see, we got, we got the leggings, replicator, generator. I'm going to make these leggings. These leggings are probably way better than my leggings. What is this? Self powered by element shards. Or link gener. I don't know what that is or what it. Oh, it's just a light. Okay, I'm I'm tripping. So it's just a light. Okay, so we got the foundations. All right, not bad. I'm I'm gonna make these. Uh, I'm gonna make these leggings though. What is it? Black black pros. We got plenty. We got plenty of everything. Yeah, we got plenty of all of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, for sure. Okay, yeah, we're gonna make these leggings real fast. Get out of here. Make these leggings and and um, be happy. 
Get out of here, make these leggings, be happy. So I'm a tad bit confused as to how I'm going to actually craft this tech replicator because apparently if I go inside of here, right? And I go to tech replicator, it says it could be crafted in a supply crate or a fabricator. I go inside of the fabricator and I type in tech and it doesn't pop up. So the only thing I think of is a supply crate. So I, I guess I could try that green one over there. Um, I'm a, Just in case we can, I don't want to have to come back over here. So I'm going to put all the resources I need to even craft this thing into my Paris or hopefully my Paris worker can carry it all. Because uh, 5,000 metal is no small feat, okay? 5,000. We have the resource. We got the metal. We got the metal, okay? We, we got the metal. But, you know, five grand is a lot. You know what I mean? Um, Hopefully, you, you should. I mean, you should be able to carry it because that's only like 700, right? And you have like 2,000. You know what I mean? So, you, sh you should be good. You should be good. So, we need that. Um, I'm gonna get everything else head over over there and see if we can actually craft this thing. Okay, so we made it over here. Um, hopefully this works. I tried a supply crate, supply crate didn't work. I tried a fiber crate, a fiber crate didn't work. And this is the only, unless this is, no, this is just an obelisk. Yeah, I was about to say, uh, is, uh, maybe this is considered a supply crate. I don't know, but let's see if we can, uh, can't even access it. Here we go. Okay, so weapons, power parts, structures, crafting, tech. There we go. Okay, so I'm assuming we just put everything in here and then uh, we'll be able to actually craft this uh, tech replicator. Let's see. Boom, boom, bop, bop, bop. Only thing we're missing is some metal. I'm just going to keep all these resources over here as well. Uh, I, might, I might not because I think with the tech rep, let's see craft there we go i think with the tech replicator that's what we're gonna use to craft all the other tech supplies so maybe our only time even coming over here is just to do this and then every other time we need to craft something tech related it'll be with the tech replicator at least that's what i'm thinking um we'll see because i still want to craft those leggings so i'm gonna go ahead and head back home and i will see you guys once i get there all right we hello turtle we placed it down and uh, i already took a little bit of a close peek in there but this thing seems like it's like almost all the structures combined because you can make metal things in here um you can you can make chitin armor in here you can make uh fur armor in here and i'm trying to think like is it worth to just have this and like just to get rid of everything else since you technically can quite literally just uh make everything in here it replicates items in here requires element to be activated so yeah um yeah i think that's pretty damn cool it just replicates items apparently whatever that means um i'm thinking i could just pretty much put anything in here and i could craft it if it's like from something else you know what i mean um but yeah this thing has there's a lot of things you can uh you can make in here obviously i don't have everything unlocked just yet but we're, we're gonna get there we're getting there we're getting there i need a lot more element and apparently you can make element um from apparently you can make element from the elemental dust or something like that let's see element yeah i can make unstable element um refined elemental dust and i can make re uh unstable element so i'm gonna do that and i'm gonna go ahead and get the resource because we got seventy thousand of this okay we got a lot of this i'm gonna go ahead and get the resources to make these tech pants here and um for some reason oh wait element 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 there we go do i only get one of these or like um or what Oh my god, that's gonna take forever to craft. And I'm overcumbered. We're gonna be here for a while. Alright, so we got everything in here. And I already got all the, re the resources I need for this. Which we're, we have a lot of resources. This is why farms are good. We're running low on the black pearls. But the black pearls you get through... I'm pretty sure you get through the caves. That's how I got my 168. Um, but if I just turn this on... Oh, I can make the element shard. I don't know what that is. This thing is going crazy. Oh my gosh, the thing is going crazy. Okay, okay, tech uh, pants or um, leggings, tech leggings. Here we go. And craft. That was fast. Wow. How do I charge these? Because apparently you have to charge them at 0%. I don't know. I don't know anything about tech, bro. I don't know how to charge anything. Um, Maybe a generator, a tech generator. For that, we need more black pearls and a lot more ingots powers tech structures and electrical structures wirelessly okay requires element to run 
and tech engrams to use. So like, how do I charge things though? Like, uh, that's, that's what I'm trying to get at. How do I charge stuff? So apparently even if I don't like charge them, I'm still able to, to wear them and they still give me like the, um, not that, I don't want you, I want my inventory. They still give me like the armor. So I got 640 armor versus like 560 or something like that of uh, when I had the other leggings on, which is still pretty cool. I just don't know what happens when they're charged. I'm assuming they have like some form of special ability. I've, I've got no idea. Let me know in the comments, like how can I actually charge them? I'm assuming it's with a generator, but we don't have the resources to make the generator. We're gonna have to fight the boss again, probably a few more times, but um, but yeah. Um, other than that, I upgraded my boxes to Pandora boxes instead of, of the, um, the Magic boxes. Um, they pretty much hold more the items and they, they make the items less weight. So instead of a 0.50%, I think, weight reduction, it's a 0.25, which is pretty lit. Um, so we're just gonna be running those instead. But other than that, that was dope. That was dope. We're gonna have to do some more cave diving, get some more artifacts so we can actually do the gamma boss, not the gamma, but the, um, this is alpha, gamma, and beta. We're gonna have to do the beta boss um, because that one drops more elements and we can unlock more things. I'm not sure what I unlocked, but I do want to unlock the chest piece for the jetpack, but I'm assuming I'm gonna have to charge it because, you know, yeah. Um, but yeah, I appreciate you guys watching this episode of Lost Island. Thank you, and I'll see you guys later.